Hey guys, what's going on? It's Mike835 again coming at you with another video review and unboxing and today I have something a little bit different for you guys. Today I picked up a Pelican 1120 case. As you see here, uh, it comes in this great box. These are the dimensions of the case right here. As you see, interior dimension 7.25 by 4.75 and of course the exterior dimensions read out at 8.12 inches times uh, 6.56 uh, as you see here they're very um, great with uh, having different colors they have these in black silver blue yellow orange desert tan and of course OD green as you see here below these are the case features which is um, I'm gonna explain a little bit about them as you see here the three basic features which is uh, watertight crush proof and dust proof of course this is the pelican 1120 these cases have uh, been around for quite some time and offer a lot of features um i collect g-shocks and all those who uh are into uh collecting uh watches or just not even watches these cases hold about just about anything they can hold guns they can hold knives they can hold cameras electronics you guys get the idea so without further ado i like to show you the case that I got today and also let's see here this is the Pelican 1120 of course I decided to go with the orange version the case it's really not that big guys as you see here I have this case in front of me so basically if I wanted to put my whole hand it's uh yeah it spans the whole um my hand is as big as the case so it's really not that big of course this is very shock resistant as you see here it's almost rock hard uh, you can't really bend it it's really sturdy coming around the front of the case um very nice heavy duty hinges as you see here it takes a little bit of effort to get them out but that's just how these cases are to make sure that your item inside is watertight and protected as you see here it takes a little bit of effort so i got it open and as you see here this has a purge valve and uh, of course you have the genuine pelican cases logo below this what does is make sure that there's no gases that gets trapped inside depending what you store um, I can see the purpose for this uh, feature which is great um, before I start to show you what I did with this case this case was a great value it was only I believe about $25 between $25 and $27 shipped I got this on Amazon I'll leave a link to uh, where I bought it and the item so if you guys are interested um, you can always check that out what I did with this case is I suited this case up for four G-Shocks so it's really cool when you're traveling to have something where your watches are really protected not just G-Shocks any watches any electronics for etc etc so uh, being an 1120 which is very uh, small cases you know and quite honestly this just looks really cool it's you know I know that I'm not the only one and the first one to review these cases but I'd like to show you how I did it how Mike 835 uh, did it um, so without further ado as you see here we have a four watch setup um, on the top as you see here very nice uh, o-ring that goes all the way around the case with the egg crate foam so when that box closes your watches electronics etc is very protected against all the elements dust water shock very sturdy you can't really bend the case in my review um, I suited this case it was included with a uh, pick and puck ugh, pick and plug foam pick and pluck and um, I decided to go with four setup um, I think it's ideal so it's pretty cool if you're traveling uh, with watches you can wear one on the wrist and uh, four in the case so total five watches and it's small enough that you could actually put this uh, small case into your like carry-on luggage uh, when you're boarding a plane uh, you know anything that sorts that line it's not too huge where you need to throw it down on a plane uh, 
and pay extra baggage so it's really cool um, as you see here I decided to go with four it's pretty cool as this is pick and pluck foam so as you see here the foam comes pre-cut so all you have to do is measure up and actually um, decide where you want to make the holes all you do is with like a, a butter knife or something like that even with you, your hands you basically <laughs> That's what they call it, uh, the pick and pluck, and you pick your plug and your way to uh, make your case how you like it. Depending, you can store many things like, uh, like I said, watches, electronics, cameras, so it's really cool. I decided to uh, show you for the display purpose of this video. I decided to go with a thousand series Frogman. You have the 94 GW9400 Rangeman. Well, as you have a 200 series Frogman on this side, and on the side you have a GW6900-1. Really cool setup. Um, in my opinion, it looks really cool. And uh, had to go with orange. You know, it just it seemed like it was the coolest color to me. Um, really happy to bring you this uh, video uh, review and unboxing. Um, Nothing along the lines of new G shocks, but something like um, little projects like this keep us motivated. And uh, going on to the next one, as you see here, it's really hard to close, uh, which is the Pelican 1120. Great little case, as well as I didn't tell you guys, it has two holes for locks here, so you can put locks on each side. And uh, it's a great value. I would recommend it to anybody who's looking for a case. These are quality cases built out um, out of Torrance, California, USA. It's an American-made product. Very sturdy. It's uh, pretty cool that you could actually find um, American-made products nowadays that are quality and are affordable for the customer. Thank you guys for watching this video. It's been Mike 835 again, giving you my insight on the Pelican 1120 case. Great little case. Uh, four watches, uh, weekend, plus it has handles, so it's really cool my opinion uh, thanks for watching if you did like my video please remember to rate comment and subscribe it's been your boy 835 signing out later